Hey guys, it's Normac here. Got an unboxing for you guys. Quite a few things, but let's go and get started. Starting with this box right here. Get some scissors. Let's get into it. Um, so yeah, some pretty neat stuff. One of these items I have already owned um, in this box, and I had to buy it again because I actually sold this item. It's a sixty dollar uh, priced item. Uh, got it at launch with my PlayStation Four. Sold it because I was getting one hundred dollars off. And like I said, it was sixty dollars. Even to this day, sixty dollars um, as far as retail price. Uh, they have had a low stock, um, but now it's back in stock. We got. PlayStation 4 camera um, with this now be, me being able to buy it again because um, I sold it for 100 like I said so I made a profit off it obviously got my money back plus a little bit more uh, from when I first bought it but yeah with me owning this camera again I could try out the new things they add on to the playroom like the this ninja mini game now so obviously some more trophies to unlock and a little bit more fun and um, they added Sackboy as a little uh, cameo character, I guess you could say. And also with this, with me um, starting to screen cap a little bit more on my PS4 and me chatting with more people on PS4, the camera is required for me to ca uh, capture voices in party chat. So it's going to help me out. So pretty sweet. And then this I had to get. I didn't get it at first only because when I found out about buying it um people are selling it more than what it was worth um i already have seasons one and two uh season um i mean two and three season four is coming out next month but i had to go ahead and get season one because i didn't get it at first i already got done watching the dragon ball z's on blu-ray um seasons two and three um but now i got seasons one, uh season one to watch pretty awesome so i've got that back so yeah i'm gonna be uh getting the um Blu-rays every month. I already have seasons four and five already pre-ordered, uh, ready to go. So um, yeah, I'm trying to go ahead and get this open. I'll go ahead and open the camera, I guess, too, while I'm at it. Um, not really in a rush, but you know, some people want to really see the insides of what you know all the stuff offers. Why is this weird feeling? It's a really weird feeling. Anyway, so yeah, we got just one, two, three, and four. So, yeah, pretty sweet. Pretty excited about that. So that'll be something I'll be watching at night because I literally just got done with watching season three. So um, grew up with Dragon Ball Z. Love it. Still love it to this day. So uh, let's go ahead and get the PlayStation camera box open. Let's have you guys look at it, I guess. It doesn't really matter too much. But like I said, some people probably want to see my impressions of it even though I have owned it before and I already have unboxed it before but I got two more items to show you guys after this they're a little bit bigger so you do get this uh, little cradle like uh, thing uh, so if you have a flat screen TV this little thing is gonna allow it to stay on it easily um, but it does bend so say if my TV is like that thick or whatever. Um, just play it on. Yeah, I'll just have my camera sitting on top of this surface area and have this kind of laying on the back of the TV. Um, so, yeah, that works if that makes any sense. Other than that, got the camera in here. It is actually small, so if you haven't seen it in person or compared to something like the Xbox One Connect, it is really small, but a really unique, different design than what you would expect of a camera for a new generation console that's going to be really helpful on uh, a lot of different situations. Um, but of course, you can use the PlayStation camera to stream games, so people will actually see your face while you're playing the game if you choose to stream. Of course, if you're playing camera-enabled games uh, or PlayStation Move titles, you'll need this camera. Um, but yeah, hopefully a more of a bright future to come for the PlayStation camera. Um, also with the new, um, crap, is it called Share Studio? Share Factory application comes to the PS4. If it's not out already, you'll be able to do picture-to-picture -picture commentary with any videos that you decide to edit on your PS4. So this is going to be convenient for that. More more uses for the camera and be an owner of a PlayStation camera. So uh, pretty awesome. But now I got that back. I have to wait a good few months for it to come back in stock and actually have the money to get it if I really needed it. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get this open. Now this is not gaming related. 
completed, but it is awesome. Um, I bought this before. It broke within the hour. Why did I buy it again? Because it was so awesome. It's like, no, I have to give this another chance. And I probably will give this thing another chance if it breaks again. So I'm going to be much more careful with it this time. It is a piece of clothing. And it's pretty freaking awesome. So, let's see. Get my scissors for this. Oh, fail. It's all good. So it is a jacket. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on and show you what's so unique about this jacket. I'm not sure if I'm being careful enough. I don't even think I'm being that careful at all. I'm just trying to make sure I can get through this video pretty fast. Alright, so, yeah, pretty pretty cool. No no designs, like, huh, where's the designs, Normac? Uh, trust me, there is a lot of design that went into this jacket. You probably already guessed what it's all about, maybe, I don't, not really sure. I'm plugging something in right here. And I need batteries, isn't that just awesome? Yeah, let me get some batteries, which are, oh, double A, I gotta think fast. Remote batteries. <laughs> All right, let's give this a try. Sorry, I'm doing this all in one take. It's just like uh, you could edit this out. Hey, I'm working. I got this. Just keep watching. This is worth it. All right. A light jacket. This is white, a white color. So if I'm like in pure dark, you're gonna see this white. And then I have, I could do a little special effect. You probably hear that faint um, dog whistle noise, and just how it is, I guess. And just have it keep blinking like that. It's really cool. My last one broke within the hour, so yeah. Hopefully this doesn't happen again. Hopefully that was just faulty. This one works out a lot better. If it's good in rain and water, I don't know. I really doubt it. But yeah, I had the little battery compartment um, button to sitting in a little pocket. So yeah. And lastly, let's get this unboxed. This one's pretty big. So I'll go ahead and move the camera over here for this and zoom in. Just because I think it's going to be best fit if I keep it on the table overall. So let's go ahead and get it open. It is part of a collector's edition. That came out a little while ago for a franchise that I really do enjoy. Um, um, I didn't buy the collector's edition because I didn't want everything in it. I just wanted this and the game. Um, I never bought the game. I just rented the game. I am planning to buy it soon and I buy it on uh, two copies. One for me and one of my friend. Um, so we could both play online. Um, it's, it's a fun game to play online on. Um, but yeah, I'm just beating around the bushes right now, so I don't give away what this item is. So this, I bought this item standalone, so without the game or any other collector's items, I got this. Alright, get it out. Okay, the battery's already dropped. And we have other stuff dropping. Okay. Oh, more batteries. And let's go and get this out. If we can. I don't think we can. Got some glass. Got a little uh, blanket, air thing, and here's the base of all this right here. And I'll show you what it is. Got plastic all over this.
So if you don't know what it is, I'll just go ahead and tell you because I'm trying to make sure I get all this out so I can show you what this is all about. This is Saints Row 4 Game of the Year Edition. No, Game of the Generation Edition. And this comes with this vase where you can put a game case in here and it will actually rotate it on this in this vase area. Um, so yeah, and I'll just put batteries at the bottom. Um, so let's go ahead and get that done right now. So you guys can kind of see it in action. Are you serious? I need, I need to unscrew it. Wow, that's terrible. Well, give me one second, guys. All right, guys. Here's that little blanket thing or whatever I was talking about that came with it. Oh, it's a little bag. All right, cool. But like I said, Saint Tro 4 Game of the Generation Edition. This item was included in there. I didn't buy the Game of the Generation Edition. I just bought the standalone rotating case, um, light case by itself for about $35. This sudden I've been one for a while and I got my hands on it. I have Infamous Second Son in here as an example with it being a great game. Look at that. When do you ever get something like that in your collector's edition? So <laughs> I had to get this when I saw it. I could buy it by itself and that's just how it works. It's pretty freaking sweet. And then right there, Saint Tro 4, Game of Generation, and some numbers below. Um, but yeah, this was supposed to be super limited, but yeah, uh, I guess it didn't sell as well. But there it is, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me your thoughts, leave some comments, give this video a thumbs up, thumbs down if you enjoyed the video or not. Subscribe if you're not already for any other game content I post on my channel. Normax signing out.